posteriorly, I've already created an incision along the front, and I can feel where my latissimus starts to invest into the, the ribs posteriorly. So here's the spines right here, thoracic spine processes along here. And I'm just going to go a little bit off the midline posterior, and I'm going to run this incision from the scapula all the way down to the most inferior rib. Make my incision through the skin. down to the latissimus, and the latissimus is getting very thin posteriorly. Okay, so I'll work the skin flap off of the latissimus to look for the latissimus. Trapezius here. And I'm looking for the interval between the paraspinals and the latissimus. This is most likely the interval right here. I'm just going to check from the other side. I came under the latissimus here. Now I'm on the back side of the latissimus. I'm sparing the paraspinals and the trapezius, and I'm working along the back. The nerve vascular bundle is tucked up under here. And then I can work all the way down along the back, as far down as I want. Now I can work back up underneath the scapula. I can work down inside the trapezius, and I have the most posterior portion of the rib right here, and you can see there's quite a bend right here. Some paraspinals coming off of those, but I can plate right overneath the paraspinal. So if you have a series of fractures, can I have the rib cutter? If you have a series of posterior fractures running here, I have easy access to the back of the ribs, whereas if I was coming from the front, it becomes very difficult to be able to work along there. In here, I have the serratus and the latissimus completely preserved, nerve vascular bundle up underneath the scapula. Trapezius here with the rhomboids coming in, I can tease through here to get up as high as I want. And again, I'm touching the first rib right there. Let um, me see the knife. So first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, 
base of the 12th, all through there. A little bit more dissection, a little bit of work. I could get up there to plate th two if I had to, but there's really no point in doing that. But you can see through these two approaches that have spared all of the musculature, you can have complete access from the entire rib with the exclusion of one and two up top.